And a number of Fort Wayne restaurants were forced to make some tough decisions to get through the COVID-19 pandemic, some actually deciding to close their doors. But one Fort Wayne favorite is opening once again, trying to make up for some lost time. Our very own Fox 55, Caleb Saylor, has more on the reopening of Brava's restaurant. Yeah, it was like one of the hardest decisions of my life. So. Bo Gonzalez served the last meal at Bravas in July. COVID-19 slashed their sales and switching to carry out only wasn't enough to keep their doors open. We didn't really see a clear way out of it. But after seven months, they're back open for business. Gonzalez says the time off gave them a chance to decide what's next. You know, having the time off to reflect and kind of uh, figure out what's really important to us um, has been great and we're really excited on you know the direction we're headed right now and that direction will look different they'll still be down on Fairfield but they're taking it back to their roots dishing out dogs and slinging burgers out of their hot dog cart and food truck three hours a day Thursday through Saturday and only taking online pre-orders on the first day they sold out in less than an hour Customers making it clear they're excited Bravis is back. I'm glad you guys opened, man. Uh, I'm excited, like I said, for Bo and um, just excited that they're going to give it a go in whatever way they can. I love what Bo's doing. Um, I love that they're, you know, they use local produce, so they're keeping their money in our community and they're just their staple in Fort Wayne. It's the coolest place in Fort Wayne. Soon they'll do a regular route in their food truck and be present at festivals, hoping to make enough money for a new building in the future. But for now, Gonzalez says it's just good to see the support after so many months. It's been cool to see all the um, customers showing their support and, you know, been very encouraging. Yeah, thank you. In Fort Wayne, Caleb Saylor, Fox 55 News. Definitely looking forward to that. Now to find more information about when they'll be operating and what food you can actually order, go ahead and click on our website at WFFT.com.